Okay, Coralie, it was a day of active riffs and some active tricks. Manic depression goes uh, A, G, D, and back to A. And the riffs are three beat riffs with active runs like this. Dramatic, open A. My girl is in C and does the whole pentatonic scale and then goes right back to the root. And then it does it on the four. On a day. And then later on the song modulates to D, so it's worth doing it. I don't need no money. also discover the beginning to the Let It Be solo, which if you leave the hammer on out, it's in C, it just goes. And then with the hammer on and the double stop, it sounds. Part of the reason you're having trouble hearing it is because you don't know what beats it starts on. One and two and three. Then we just talked about a couple more generic tricks. I'm looking at my notes here. So, you know, you have a C chord, you can connect it to the A form of it. And then the, the scale is the go-between. So. When you're here, you can do no harm. You know, you can hammer on any of the voices. Even do the double suspension, which is like a sixth or the third. So you can think about those as chord embellishments. So if you're and then you move to D. Goofing off, do an E. But then another move, you can think about the same move coming off a, a, an E form chord, in which case it becomes. Or so it. So you could do like a C. Which then goes to the four chord. Five. 